Hi, MTV News. I'm Camila Mendez on the set of Riverdale. I'm Charles Melton. This is Lily Reinhardt. It's Madeline Patch. I'm Casey Cox. Jordan Connor here. It's Vanessa Morgan. It's Ashley Murray, and you're on the set of Riverdale, and we're shooting our big musical episode, The Heathers. Well, it's a great fit because they are murders. So, you know, it's like you're in, this is murder town. This is like murder city. So anything where people don't make it is usually perfect for Riverdale. The gang is doing Heather's the Musical with Kevin directing yet again. Betty, Veronica, and Cheryl play the three Heathers with Josie as playing Veronica. It's definitely an angsty episode. Everybody's, yeah, I think everybody's kind of expressing that angst and coming together and saying like, Okay, enough is enough. It speaks to every high schooler, or really to everyone who's been in high school, which is most of us, really. It just meshes with the storyline perfectly, so they couldn't have picked a better musical to do. I think the songs in the musical are a really nice, fresh take on, on kind of like that teen angst with like a bit of a dark twist. Oh gosh, I don't even know what the premise of the episode is. I, I couldn't tell you, there's always so many things going on in Riverdale that there's like eight premises. I would have to say Lily surprised me the most of everyone. And not in that, like I didn't think she was a good singer or anything, but she's, an awesome singer and like her and Cami and Madeline as the as the Heathers is unbelievable. Like one of my favorite songs is Candy Store that they perform and it's just unbelievable how talented they are and they just blew me away. It was exciting to hear Casey sing more because he's one of the few people that actually has like some, I think he has proper training and he definitely did it a lot in college. So, you know, being able to hear him sing has been really fun. It's a tie between Camilla and Casey. Camilla had this number she did called Lifeboat, and it's just so beautiful, and she sounds amazing in it. Probably Jordan, uh, who plays Sweet Pea, because last year he wasn't even in the musical, and you know, we've always talked about music, but he was nervous going in, and he went in there and he gave it his all, and I think you guys will be very surprised with him this episode too. Madeline has a dancing background, so she's like super flawless on stage. Like, I had no idea, that was amazing. And Vanessa, who plays Tony, she's like, that is her actual voice. Like, she sings like an angel and I was just kind of just blown away by her ability, like as an actress, to be such a good singer. Charles was nervous about singing and I thought he did a great job and same with Jordan and he was doing a great job singing and the boys are just killing it dancing and all the girls have great voices. Zoe really surprised me. She plays Evelyn. She kept saying like, oh, I don't sing, I don't blah, 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 I don't, I don't move, I don't dance and, and she killed it in every way. Like I remember hearing the first time she sang and I'm like, you actually do sing. I have a whole new respect for Casey and uh, Cami because they can sing and I can't. I think the biggest difference between last year and this year's musical is just overall our confidence level. I think last year a lot of us were very stressed out about the monstrosity, like the bigness of doing a musical episode and all of the added work that would be into it and could we do it and would it be pulled off properly and we had no idea and we watched it and thank God we did. Similar to to carry Heather's fits Riverdale quite well. Definitely not a coincidence that we're doing Heather's, that's for sure. Especially the music, not necessarily the plot, but more so the songs that the characters sing really just ties in perfectly with with everything that the characters are going through. You look at the Heather's and the different the different girls in Riverdale and you can kind of piece them together. Heather's blends into to Riverdale through the character that Veronica's playing, which is Heather McNamara. They they both are going through very emotional times and dealing with the people around them and all the chaos around them um, and all the pressure that they're feeling at that individual moment. So, you know, Veronica sings Lifeboat as Heather McNamara in, in our musical episode this season. And I think she's really relating to the kind of feeling of your world is crumbling around you. The biggest challenge has been, as per usual in Riverdale, time. I think we have such big episodes that fitting them into eight days is always difficult, and then fitting in rehearsals and studio time and all of that. I had to do a dance with Madeline and Cammie uh, for the song Candy Store, which is pretty, pretty, it's not even that hard of a dance, but like for me, it was pretty challenging. I think the most challenging part is just probably lack of sleep. And the choreography has been a lot easier because we've had more time. And I think uh, the production learned from last time. My favorite number so far has definitely been Candy Store. It was so fun. Madeline, Lily, and Cammie just absolutely killed their dance sequence. It's super fun. And then I come in and me and Cheryl have like 
a riff off dance battle. The audience is gonna love seeing Veronica, Cheryl, and Betty doing a number together, especially like a really kind of fun number where we're all just being like sexy and fierce. The choreography in that one was really fun to learn. I'm excited for fans to see the finale. Just to see everybody up on stage, we had 500 extras in the uh, auditorium to fill up all those seats. It felt very real. There was a buzz in the green room. It felt like we were actually going out there to do a performance. It's just sort of everywhere. I'm just like, ooh, ah. Like it's just, that's, that's me, that's me. <laughs>